This short video shows how to set up Sage CRM's Exchange integration feature and be ready to go in less than 5 minutes. Once the integration is configured, all appointments, tasks and contacts will sync seamlessly between the Sage CRM server and the Exchange server. That's right, there's no more client-side syncing between Sage CRM and Outlook. Calendar integration includes support for subject and location information, all-day and recurring appointments, and for external attendees. This is a powerful feature that allows Sage CRM users to invite multiple users and multiple contacts to the same meeting in CRM. The feature is complemented by a simple client-side plugin for filing emails and adding Outlook contacts to CRM. This plugin can be installed by a system administrator via Active Directory Group Policy, but it is possible to allow users to install it manually. Let's get started. You'll need a working 7.1 Sage CRM install, Exchange Server 2007 SP3 or higher, or Exchange Server 2010 SP1 or higher. Your organization's Exchange Web Service URL and logon credentials. And access to all Exchange mailboxes that you intend to sync with. Log on to Sage CRM as an administrator and go to Administration, System, System Behavior, and set the Use Exchange Server Integration setting to Yes. Go to Administration, Email and Documents, and select the Exchange Server Integration option. Select the Connection Management option and then click the New button. Enter the Exchange Web Service URL and log on information. If you want your users to install the plugin, set the Allow Users to Manually Install Plugin field to Yes and click Save. Once a connection has been established, click Continue. You can then start enabling users' mailboxes for synchronization with Exchange. In the User Mailbox Management tab, click Change and select the Synchronize checkbox to enable eligible Sage CRM users. Click Save to establish a connection between the user's mailboxes and Sage CRM. Sage CRM connects to the mailboxes of the selected users. Click Continue and you can see the mailboxes to which a connection has been successfully established. Note that no synchronization takes place until you enable the connection in the next step. Go to Administration, Email and Documents, Exchange Server Integration, Synchronization Management and review the sync options. For example, you may want to change the sync direction settings or frequency of synchronization. When you are finished, click Enable to activate the synchronization process. The appointments, tasks and contacts of the users you selected in the previous step are synchronized between Sage CRM and their Exchange mailboxes according to the sync options you have selected. You can check the fields of the status panel to confirm when a sync is complete. Let's go back over the main steps. Check that. You meet the prerequisites. The Use Exchange Server Integration option is set to Yes. You've set up a connection to your Exchange Web Service. Sage CRM users are enabled for synchronization, and you've enabled the synchronization process. Finally, you should notify your users that the Exchange synchronization feature is now active, and let them know whether they need to install the Outlook plugin manually, which they can do from My CRM Preferences, and your Sage CRM Exchange Sync is ready to go.